वेलकम फ्रेंड्स लेट अस कंटिन्यू टू स्टडी स्टीम जनरेटर ऑन माय यूट्यूब चैनल इन टूडेज लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट द कंस्ट्रक्शन एंड वर्किंग ऑफ कोचरन बोइलर कोचरन बोइलर बिफोर वी स्टडी द कंस्ट्रक्शन एंड वर्किंग ऑफ द कोचरन बोइलर लेट अस स्टडी इन विच कैटेगरी or in which classification the cochran boiler is classified so the cochran boiler is classified as vertical boiler because it has a vertical drum natural draft as the movement of the hot gases and smoke gases is due to the natural that is the density difference multi tube boiler because it has the multi tubes internally fired because the burning of fuel takes place inside the boiler drum and fire tube, uh, tube boiler because the hot gases passes through the tubes and water surrounds the tubes so this was the classification of cochran boiler construction at the bottom of a vertical boiler drum so it has a vertical boiler drum and at the bottom hemispherical shape combustion chamber is provided so this one is a combustion chamber and the shape of the combustion chamber is hemispherical shape smoke boxes are provided at the left and the right side of the vertical boiler drum so this is a vertical boiler drum this one is the left hand side smoke box and this one is the right hand side smoke box combustion chamber is connected to left side of the smoke box and chimney is connected to right side of the smoke box so this one is the left hand side smoke box and the combustion chamber is connected to the left hand side smoke box the chimney is connected to the right hand side smoke box both the smoke boxes are connected by number of fire tubes so this one is the left hand side smoke box it is also known as the extended combustion chamber and this one is the right hand side of smoke box both the smoke boxes are connected through number of tubes and these are these tubes are the fire tubes now we are going to study the working of cochran boiler initially half of the boiler drum is filled with the water so half of the boiler drum is filled up the water why because water is required to convert the water into steam and from water only steam can be uh, received so the water surrounds the fire tube and the hemispherical combustion chamber so as the water is filled up inside the boiler drum so what happens the tube is surrounded by the water and also the outside of the hemispherical uh, combustion chamber the water is there fuel is supplied to the combustion chamber and burn so the through the fire door the fuel is supplied and the burning of the fuel is carried out hot gases move up and enter the left hand side smoke box so after burning of the fuel whatever the hot gases are generated they move to the left hand side of the smoke box hot gases then pass through the number of fire tubes and enter the right hand side smoke box so hot gases which has entered into the left hand side of uh, smoke box or also known as the extended combustion chamber now passes through number of fire tubes and then enters into the right hand side smoke box due to the movement of the hot gases through fire tube water surround the fire tubes is heated so when the hot gas is passes from number of tubes and as the tube is surrounded by the water water gets heated then the hot gas is from the right hand side smoke box enters into the chimney so whatever the hot gas is collected into the right hand side smoke box they are entered into the chimney the mountings 
coupled with the Cochran boiler are pressure gauge, water level indicator, safety valves, blow up cock, feed check valve, steam shop valve, and fusible plug. Optional accessories that can be connected to the Cochran boiler are superheater, economizer, air preheater, feed pump, and anti priming pipe. Dear students, kindly ask your queries in the comment box of my YouTube channel. Also, kindly like, share, and subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.